It is a beautiful spring day in Myrtle Beach. We're here at Market Common. This is the latest listing, 861 Murray Avenue. Shops and restaurants are right down the street here, two blocks away from the King Street Grill. So a nice, easy walk. This is a brick, three-story, two-bedroom, two-full-bath, two-half-bath townhouse that is in pristine shape. Um, I'm going to venture to say this is the nicest Drayton I've been in in a long time, if maybe not ever. Um, got another nice patio out front here. What's interesting about this townhouse is this is one of the extended Drayton plans. If you look at some of the other ones here, you'll notice this one sticks out. Got about an extra two feet uh, on each floor of this townhouse. And while that might not sound like much, it makes a really big difference in the first floor officer study, on the second floor living room, and the third floor bedroom. I mean, right when you walk into this place, you can just see how nicely it's been maintained. Uh, I wish you could smell this video because this place smells great. It looks great. Um, it is just nice. Chair rail moldings, picture frame moldings, crown molding, smooth ceilings. I always tell people these are kind of like brownstones in New York City. So when you walk in here, look at this detail work. When you walk in here on the right, you've got a little office or a study. Um, a lot of people will put French doors on this opening. This particular owner has it set up as a little sitting room. Built-in bookshelves. stencils on the wall here which do come off if you don't like the quotes and buy this place you can always remove them very easily but just a nice um, larger sitting area than you see in the other Drayton's or officer study nice size room on the first floor here we also have a half bath so you've got your own bathroom on this floor it's also the HVAC systems on this level. Uh, there are two for this townhouse. One on the first floor, or one on the first two floors, and one that services just the third floor. Nice storage closet here, coat closet. There's another big storage closet here. This also doubles as an elevator shaft. So there's already the sunken slab here and support in the walls. You can put an elevator right in this unit, if you so wish. Last but not least, we've got an oversized single car garage. You can see they've got a Trans Am here. But plenty of storage spaces on the sides. I see so many garages where you, single car garages where you come in and you can't even open the garage door without hitting the wall. This one has space, and a good amount of space on either side. Plenty of space for storage racks. There's also a storage closet here with a hot water heater. So very nice so far, but you haven't even seen the nicest part yet. I'm sorry if I'm moving too fast. Again, stairs, but there's a landing on each Stairwell. All right, Let's see if I can get this reveal. Look at this kitchen. You've got a gorgeous kind of dining room, kitchen area here. Lots of light, granite countertop, stainless steel appliances. Nice little island in the center. This is kind of a unique feature for this town. I've never seen one like this before. They've got a little butler's pantry here built-in shelves, really, really pretty. Of course, they also have a huge regular pantry. And since this is a second home, the pantry is a little bare. But this is just really, really nice. Nice bar area, got a built-in wall oven and a microwave. Three windows in the back, granite countertops. I mean, the place is just pristine. It looks like it's brand spanking new. There's a 
downdraft grill here. These are modular units, so you can add more eyes and take away the grill side or add more grills and take away the eye side. Nice space for a table here. There is a whole nother half bath on this floor. And look at the wallpaper in here. I mean, it is nice, really neat. And I'm sure not cheap. And then this is the bigger kind of extended living room for this larger size drape and floor plan. Again, big windows, plantation shutters, big room. Look at this custom fan. I mean, wow. Place for TV. Uh, they've done something neat here. Again, this is a storage closet that doubles as an elevator shaft. Put a desk in here. Really neat way to utilize that space. I'm gonna try to kind of pan around this room real quick. Kind of, you've seen this picture in the listing. I kind of like looking down from the stairwell into the living area. Just really, really pretty. All right, last but not least, the third floor. Washer and dryer with built-in cabinets above. That's something that was added. It's not a standard feature. This really has two master bedrooms. You've got one bedroom here. And again, Lots of room. Again, custom fans. Nice window treatments. Big bed, end tables. There's a bath here and they added shower doors, which I like. Granite countertops. Again, this is that same storage closet slash elevator shaft. And again, lots of extra storage here. And then this bedroom is where I really notice a lot of the space for having that extra two feet on the front. I mean, they've got chairs, tables, beds. Nice size master suite here. Nice plantation shutters. Again, gorgeous ceiling fans. I'm standing in it, so I'm gonna turn around. You've got a really nice size walk-in closet. And the closet actually even goes back to the right behind the door here. So they've got the his part of the closet and, of course, the hers part of the closet. And just beautiful master bedroom here. And then last but not least, this bedroom has a step-in shower with a seat. Granite countertops and me. So 861 Murray Avenue, right here in Market Common. Two bedrooms, two full baths, two half baths. A little over 1,800 square feet heated. Um, immaculate shape. Probably the, the best Drayton townhouse I've been in in, in a long, long time. Um, and on top of that, it's one of the extended Drayton, so it's got more square footage. Close to the shops and restaurants, close to the beach. For more information on this and other townhouses in Market Common, give me a call. My name's Jay Benoit. You can reach me at 843 222 nine one three five of course all that information is written right down here in the um, section on youtube and check out some of my other videos hope you have a great day